World-class chef Michael Gilligan has made a name for himself as executive chef at Adrio, one of the finest restaurants in the U.S. But he didn't get there by being nice. Finish it. Don't put it in the window like that. Finish the dish. Hundreds have vied for the opportunity to learn from the master, but only two made the final cut. They think they know what they're in for, but they haven't got a clue. Let's go with those appetizers, This is Michael Gilligan's world. This is Satan Pantry. Tonight we have a big special party and I need some help. Okay. And I guess you two are the best that we've got. Nice belt, by the way, I like that. Thank you, I wanna look cute. And you do look cute, but nobody sees you back here. This is not Deco Drive, this is the kitchen. This is how it's supposed to look. So you want us to make it look like that? So that's the finished dish. I need 30 of them in 20 minutes. Let's go. Okay. Where are you going? I think you just want make to your own. Go. What did it look like? Where's that little round thing? Oh, right here. Uh. Lynn Martinez has no business working in the kitchen, right? She's completely clueless. Now I'm sitting there working and she's stuffing her face. And for the record, there were no carbs involved. So there's that. You're kind of crowding my area. 20 minutes after getting their first ticket, Lynn and Louie have still not produced a dish. In the dining room, customers are getting impatient. Lynn, Louie, let's go with those appetizers. Jesus. Hey, listen, we're doing the best that we can, okay, lady? I don't need any pressure from you. I don't need any pressure from you guys. And then Louis got into an argument with the staff. I mean, first rule of the kitchen, and I don't even work in a kitchen, I know this, make friends with the staff. Duh! How are we doing over here? How many have we made? Half of one, and so we should serve it like this? And so people are gonna, people are gonna eat this? Eat this. Dude, this is, this is this is not true. And what is this? It looks like a what is this? <laughs> After a disastrous appetizer, Lynn and Louie attempt to rally with the main course, forcing one contestant to face her worst fears. <laughs> Next, on Satan's Pantry. Last time on Satan's Pantry, Lynn and Louie failed to deliver an edible appetizer. Now, they'll attempt to serve a main course. Let's go. Awesome. awesome. Now we're going to wrap up some lobster. Are you going to kill those? But one contestant starts to crumble under pressure. If you oh don't God. kill them, somebody will. We're in South Florida. It's a high-end restaurant. You're going to serve live lobster. Lynn couldn't kill the lobster, dude. Okay, let's go. Let's go. No, no, let's go. no, no, no. no. Yourselves. It should be you guys in the pot, not this poor lobster. While Chef tries to console Lynn, well, nobody gives a Louis Good takes guy. the lead with ah. a bold Thai curry sauce, yeah, but quickly gets ahead of himself. Did you taste it? No. You have to taste to see what things taste like. I think Louis made a huge mistake by not tasting his sauce. I mean, hello, how are you gonna know how it tastes if you don't taste it? Hello. Okay, guys, how does it look? I think it did pretty good. What do you think? It looks great. Guys, to be honest, I think it looks like vomit. It looks like it was put together by a four-year-old. That looks like it's been eaten once before. This is, there's, there's no... You told me to taste it, bro. I told you to taste it. I didn't tell you to regurgitate it. I it's... worked really hard on that, Yeah, chef. yeah, yeah, you worked, worked really hard. I worked really hard on that. Yeah, but it was a load of <laughs> Now get out. What? Get out of the kitchen. Get out. We're not done. Get out. Dessert. Get out of the kitchen. Get Why out of the kitchen. Dessert? Get out of here. With their culinary dreams dashed, Lynn and Louie leave Satan's pantry for the last time. She ruined it for both of us. It was my dream to be a chef at Satan's Pantry. You know, and, and, and Lynn shot that dream right to hell. While Lynn and Louie continue to work in television, their cooking is restricted to microwavable frozen dinners.